what's up? We live for all the out there. What's up? Y'all want to be famous? Here you go. Welcome back to Scandalous Los Angeles TV, where we expose the exposers. CS2 back has been getting his back beaten like a drum, y'all. He has completely lost control of his exposers, and the exposers have completely lost sight of their former objective. They've been spending so much time with their backs against the ropes, they've had absolutely no time to present paperwork to the people. Today on Clubhouse CS2 back, tried to act like he didn't know that Deuce M's filed a $5 million lawsuit against him. YouTube and world star hip hop. You guys, listen to all of the excuses CS2 back comes up with in an attempt to dismiss the truth and the seriousness of the lawsuit. So, w w what about this uh, what? $5 million lawsuit? What five? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't yeah, what, somebody's what, supposed to Oh, yeah, that. they said they got a $5 million they lawsuit. Said they said they're suing you for $5 million. You and World Star, bro. You World Star and YouTube. Yeah. Hey. Two world, I don't have nothing to do with World Star. So, I don't know. I, I've been, I don't post on World Star. So, what are they suing me for? How about that? CS2 back has already began the deflect and dismiss campaign. CS2 back had Deuce M's video taken down claiming that he was the rightful owner of the content. Content that Deuce M's already had copywritten. Somebody tell Porky that he can't do that. And now it's looking like the $100,000 that Porky was gonna use to bail out Keefy D is now gonna end up going into Deuce's pockets. This is why we call him Easy Cash App Jones. They said it was something that had to do with some copyright abuse or some you did in respect to that uh, that documentary of that CS2 back, whatever that Deuce name was running. What are you and, talking uh, about? That's my life. I dude. ain't talking about it. That's what they talking about. niggas is weird, bro. God, the nigga telling me about my lawsuit that I filed. What the fuck are you talking about? Deflect and dismiss again. Porky tries to say Deuce's lawsuit doesn't matter because he is the one who has a defamation lawsuit. So he deflects by saying he's the one with the lawsuit, allowing him to dismiss Deuce's lawsuit. Just for the record, you guys, Porky, the pit poodle Piru, has no lawsuit at all. And that's why I was like, damn. That's my lawsuit that I filed. You said five million, now he's saying you gonna hold him five million. Yeah, he said you gonna hold him five. Okay, well, I got you. <laughs> you, whack, you ain't see that they was running that? Bro, they can run what they want. This is the real life. See, y'all gotta stop being so slow. <laughs> Tell a nigga to show you the lawsuit. Come on, Doug. I can show you my lawsuit. The pit poodle Pie Roo hasn't showed anyone any lawsuit ever. This same clown told us he filed a lawsuit against the FBI when they raided his house. He said he filed a lawsuit against Mika when she made his butt cheeks public. He even said he had a lawsuit against Mark Stevens. See what I mean when I say his back is against the wall? I feel sorry for Big Chuck. Big Chuck is forced to act like he doesn't see the absolute clown CS2 back is. Because CS2 back went and trademarked Chuck's company name, Death of the Clout Chasers, before Chuck could. Which is the reason Chuck has to write D-O-T-C-C -C, instead of just saying Death of the Clout Chasers. I think Chuck feels if he keeps it cool with Porky, then maybe he'll give it back. I don't know what it is. But that's the kind of rat bastard CS2 back is. No, he showed, he showed some shit, bro. I can show you the court, man. It showed some shit he made up. Yeah, he showed some shit. He like, yo, how the fuck you suing me? Back. How you suing me for my defamation of care suit against? And listen, this was crazy. So, let's get this right. Deuce M's is suing World Stars? He's suing yeah. you. World oh, my God. That means that mean him and Big U didn't fell out. That's a good, good stuff. Deflect and dismiss again. Now the deflection is that if Deuce is suing World Star, then him and Big U must have fell out. Now he can dismiss the case Deuce has against him. If he's suing World Star, that means him and Big U didn't fell out. That's Big U. That's his relationship. It's World Star. That's great to know. <laughs> that's over with then. If that nigga suing World Star, that means his relationship with Big U is over with. Cause oh, that, oh. 
his relationship. Who knows? They could have just put that out there as a play. Ain't no telling. Well, bro, it don't. That's where the math don't make sense. He leaning on Big U to do some things. World stars Big U's relationship. I can show you the paperwork where my attorneys tried to put Big U in the suit, and I wouldn't let him do it. So I don't put niggas' names in paperwork. But the company, and it ain't even World Star. That's how I know he capping. The company's L.A. Media. Now, Porky deflects by saying you can't sue World Star. You have to sue the company that owns it. He says the company is L.A. Media, and since they said World Star, CS2 back can now dismiss the lawsuit against him, saying it's cap. Just for the record, CS2 back is lying again like he always does. The company that owns World Star is Media Lab LA, not LA Media. Porky lies about everything. You can't sue World Star. World Star is owned by LA Media. Hey, what? You say you send that shit to your lawyer. It don't matter. I mean, you can send whatever you want to send. But the company's LA Media, bro. You can't even sue World Star. Hey, I wonder how they got to the number five tickets, though. No, man. Was he going to make five tickets off the video? Fuck out of here, bro. That nigga talking out of his ass, bro. That's what I'm saying. Y'all be like, these niggas ain't got nothing to talk about, so they say anything because they know some niggas will talk about anything. Nigga, that's content. He, he just running content. He got to be. Because I mean, was that, ain't, five, that ain't five. my type of content, bro. I no. bet you this. If I brought my two shit, it's gonna be very, very real. Boom, 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 boom. You got LA Media World Star saying, okay, we have investigated, and yes, we're pulling it down. <laughs> we see that Mr. Jones is not named in any of these allegations. Boom, 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 boom. Come now. Now, the nigga had your name up there. He had some shit where he, it showed you had pulled it down. Uh, he had, he had, uh, and you got this nigga over there. It's the same nigga that makes fake make purple work, right? That's nigga. Yeah, I, got yeah. I got time. Deflect and dismiss. Now the deflection is that Deuce made some fake work before, so we can dismiss the whole lawsuit. I did say that though, but uh, and Chuck did say that that whenever some shit comes up, it's gonna have his credibility in question because of that fake paperwork. But first of all, in order to sue for five million, you gotta justify five million. No, uh, you know that fake paperwork shit got them niggas, man. Forever. They ran fake paperwork on they stuff. Yeah, that's, that's what put everything in question. But I don't know who this girl Henny is. But uh, Somebody don't want me to mention her name and never gonna happen. Uh, she said you did oh, mention that, her. That she is. said you said... I ain't mentioned that woman name. She said you said that she a dog or some shit. What she said? I ain't oh, never mentioned that woman name. Don't know the woman. That's Do Sims attempting to get me to mention somebody name I don't know. I don't know nothing about it. It's but I will. Woman. Well, what I will say is this: it's a few people that do know her. She right over there in New York. That ain't got nothing to do with me. Don't blame me. I don't know her. Whatever happened, happened. Don't you guys hate the way this fat bastard sits on Clubhouse with the mic all in his mouth as he smacks his food? There is something extremely zesty about the way he does that. Now he trying to threaten Henny, as if someone in New York is actually sliding for the pit poodle. All this because Porky keeps getting exposed. That had to be, a, that had to be one of them cruise ship hits or something. I don't know who that lady is, bro. <laughs> I don't know. That's, I mean, it's my What cruise idea. ships? What? We talking about a cruise ship? <laughs> I ain't never been on a cruise ship. What you talking about? I'm trying to figure out, man. This... I've never been on a cruise ship in my life. I'm no, just I'm, I'm just bullshit with the cruise ship. But I'm just like, where did this lady come from? I don't she... know the lady, bro. It's clout. She's I am the drink of the internet. internet. I'm the Drake of podcast. Mention whack name if you nobody, know and that's the that's the picture. They gonna look at you. Well, here go the thing. I, I don't know her. I don't know nothing about her. Even have a conversation. I don't know the lady. She on she on your life, G. She ain't on my life. Oh, she's on YouTube life. Yeah, well, she on your YouTube life. Mm -hmm. This is crazy. Yeah, five million. <clears throat> Yeah, and, 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 and 
I'm suing World Star and him for five million. This nigga right here. Now watch this, bro. That's how you know he got a rat in him. Cause I didn't even include him in my civil suit. That's how you know he got a rat in him. Cause I didn't even include him in my civil suit. Anybody who knows anything about CS2 back knows that he was gonna pull this play out of the playbook. I'm surprised that we had to hear him go through all of those other excuses before he got to this one. First he said, it was his defamation lawsuit. Then he said it was Cap, because LA Media were the owners. Then it was Deuce, and Big U must have fell out. After that he said Deuce made fake paperwork before. Then he sent a subliminal threat to our sister Henny. After all those excuses, Porky said Deuce got rat in him. This shit is hilarious. Porky took off all of his clothes, got butt naked, laid on his belly and jumped on Clubhouse with Chuck to lie as usual. You feel me? I don't put no nigga name in no paperwork, bro. A no-no. So that's, when I, that's why I'm saying it, it can't be real. Ain't no way. What I, ain't, I ain't put nigga, listen, I can show you on my text blast. My attorney tried to put his name, Big U, now today. Take them names out of there. LA Media World Star only. It's they platform, they posted it. It's they obligated to it. I don't sue individual street niggas. Not don't happen. I'm not pointing the finger at damn niggas. So if that nigga saying he done put my name in some paperwork, then we know he got rat in him. Right or wrong? Hey, this is a blood, right? phenomenon, this this lawsuit. Type of deal. No, 40 Glock did the same shit. Got on stage, on stand, and the judge said, Do you see the man that assaulted you? He said, Yes, he's right there. He beat me so bad, Your Honor, that my dick won't get hard no more. I can't even have kids. Yeah, that's telling. 40 Glock said that? On my mama. You want to bet? I'll go get the transcript. You want to bet? No, nah, don't do it. That nigga got on the stand, nigga, pointed that man out. He pointed that gang? Do you see the man in here that assaulted you? Pointed right at him. <coughs> and said, he beat me so bad, I can't get an erection, I can't have kids anymore. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go get them transcripts. That's good work. <laughs>